Taking down NHS waiting lists was a Labour promise at the general election. It's also top of the FM's list of priorities after a summer listening exercise. Plans for Welsh patients to travel to England and vice versa, bear in mind cross-border treatment already happens, were reported widely during Labour's conference in Liverpool. But at First Minister's questions today, the FM said that people had been putting words into the Welsh Government's mouths over what was announced, and that movement of patients might be tough. If we can help each other out, we will, and we do. When we look at capacity, frankly, there's not that much capacity in England either at the moment when it comes to... It. I'll tell you what it's about. It's about learning best practice. The best practice involves, amongst other things, English dentistry learning from the appointment system in Wales, Wales learning how England is creating 40,000 extra NHS appointments a week. But what about cross-border surgery? Listen to this on Wales Today on the 23rd of September, on the day the plan was announced at the Labour Party conference. If I'm watching this and I'm on a waiting list in Wales, I've been on it for 18 months waiting for that procedure to happen. Am I any closer to having it done because of this plan? Yes, because what we're doing is creating mutual aid partnerships across England and Wales. So English NHS trusts and Welsh health boards will work together to bring down those surgery waiting lists through identifying capacity in the systems in different specialties and making sure that we can get people into theatre, get their operations. Back in the centre, the leader of Plaid Cymru said patients were being given false hope. Oh, this is your announcement of new cross-border working. The person is genuinely th making it up as she goes along, I think. You know, we, we know nothing about these plans because there were no plans, uh, were there? Health will continue to dominate the Welsh political agenda with waiting lists at a record high. But despite that and Labour's big announcement, it looks unlikely there'll be a surge of Welsh patients going over the border for operations in England anytime soon.